You're special. <laughs> looking, looking at you in those green pajamas, mate. We all know you're special. <laughs> all right. Well, we've been friends for a long time, and think, oh, it'll never happen. We keep publishing books for other people. Why don't we do our own? And my last little thank you is to my little daughter, Taryn. Taryn used to listen to all my stories when I wrote, uh, made them up at night time. They look lovely. This is a pretty cool book. Damn, they're here. <laughs> Really? I was lovely to be able to get a peak preview. Uh, read it to son Alex, uh, who's five, uh, and it was a wonderful story to be able to have a very New Zealand Christmas story. So much of the stuff we get about Christmas is all Northern Hemisphere-ish, snowish, and those things. And to read a book that's about Crusaders, rugby, and sky towers, and beehives, and all those things that are very New Zealand makes it a very special Christmas book. Yep, I've got the Crusaders in there, which, which is the real reason why I really like the book. I think it's really cool, but it's really nice because obviously they've tied in the Crusader horses and, and it is the main attraction. Obviously, if young girls are into their horses, they'd always want to visit the Crusaders, so it's pretty cool. By delivering my presents in New Zealand. Uh, uh, oh shoot! Well, I think it's pretty cool, you know, just having a wee quick look at it. It um, looks pretty exciting and a really good story, so. It's about two young girls who hop on a horse with their pyjamas on by the look of things and fly around New Zealand and have some, um, some interesting adventures. I think it's a fantastic story for Nelson and part of the creative spirit here that you've got Nelsonians creating a children's book that's special about a very New Zealand Christmas and to have that creativity in Nelson is something all us Nelsonians should be pretty proud of. Here we go, Todd's got a cup of cake. Woohoo! Here we go! Now you're going to get to have a piece of this beautiful chocolate velvet book cake. The books have already, have already winged their way to Canada. Oh, it's stunning. Um, I think the colours in the book are, are tremendous. It's, it's, it really is um, just bringing the whole of New Zealand to life. And <laughs> he's turned up and he's, just, he's still cutting cake. <laughs> He thought he was one of the stallions in the book. <laughs> <laughs>